tengo hambre. Hola, ¿qué más pues? I'm Violeta Bernal, I'm a Spanish teacher, and today you are going to learn Spanish to survive in a restaurant. Vamos a comer. Ay, vamos a flipflop. Hola, ¿me das el menú, por favor? In Colombia, the service is not the best. Although, there are some places where you can find good service. But, most of them are fine restaurants. I'm going to give you two tips to get a better service. Call the waitress by her name. I'm a friendly. That's going to work for sure. Remember that here in Medellin is all about to be friendly. In some places they have the name here, but if you cannot see the name, then ask for it. If you don't know how to ask for the name, then check this video. Do not call the waitress like this. I used to be a waitress. And to be honest, when a customer called me like this, I just ignore that person. I mean, I'm not a dog, so what? Are you going to dance flamenco or what? Oiga! This is just unrespectful. Mozo! In Argentina or Chile, that is okay. But in Colombia, no. Because in Colombia, mozo or moza means lover. So be careful. Camarero. Probably if you say this to the waitress, she's going to be like, Camarero. This means waitress, but in España, tío. Vosotros tenéis que decir en Colombia, mesero. Tienes bandeja paisa. No vendemos bandeja paisa. Bandeja paisa is a typical plate from Medellin. This plate has 10 ingredients. Frijoles, arroz, maduro, chicharrón, chorizo, aguacate, morcilla, carne molida, huevo, arepa. If you come to Medellin, you have to try it. And then, you should run all around the city. ¿Qué nos recomiendas? Les puedo recomendar buffalo chicken sandwich. Buffalo chicken sandwich es picante. Es picante means it's hot when you are talking about the flavor. Es caliente. Es caliente means it's hot when you are talking about the temperature. If you're going to order steak, the terms for this are Azul, medio, tres cuartos, cuatro cuartos. ¿Me das por favor un buffalo chicken sandwich? Sí. I know that for many of you this sounds so rude, but in Espanol this is okay. Is Jasmine going to pay the check? Are they going to get the food on time? Is Rich going to ask to Jasmine for a second date? Find out the answers next week. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter and Instagram. Ciao pues!